What's up everyone? Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Today we're taking a look at Polygon and its recent price action and make sure to watch the video till the end for a price prediction for the short and the long term as well. First things first, please smash the like, subscribe and hit the bell icon. YouTube is not pushing crypto content out currently and our subscribers aren't getting notifications. So make sure to join our free Telegram to stay up to date with all of our videos as they are posted. Links in the description. It really helps if you hit the like. We're posting four videos per day, so come back every day for daily updates and analysis. And make sure to comment down below for your chance to win a hardware wallet in our new monthly giveaway. We'd also like to thank you all so, so much for your support. We've just hit 10k subscribers, so make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. This is not financial advice. Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Let's begin. What's up guys, so just before we begin, we've had many reports that our subscribers aren't seeing our content, and this is most likely because you haven't hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon with all notifications turned on. Give it a tap now, turn on all notifications, and you'll most likely see most of our videos being posted. Also, if you want to support the channel, make sure to tap that like, it really, really helps us out. We're posting four videos per day, so make sure to check back every single day for daily updates. So we're just taking a look at Polygon here, and as we can see, Things going very, very well indeed, aren't they? You can see quite clearly. We've had a very nice bounce off the downside in the past few months. Obviously, we had this ever since May. We had this big, long, drawn out consolidation and uh, with retracement period, didn't we? Where we're basically forming this big descending wedge, just like most cryptocurrencies. Obviously, we were all just waiting for that bounce at that point. And you can see, obviously, we formed a range, basically looking something like this, where, you know, we've come down come down we made our range low and we made our range high looking something like this with the fake out to the upside didn't we where we come back up we had the huge bounce off the downside but then we come down we obviously get stuck under this level again this level of resistance here at around two dollars and then ever since then we've been stuck in that range haven't we come all the way down we obviously had the fake out to the downside of the range and of the descending wedge everyone's saying we're in a bear market we're in a bear market bitcoin's below 30k everyone was obviously getting absolutely distraught Basically saying we're in a bear market, we need to sell everything now, short in the bottom of the market. And then before you know it, huge short squeeze, we come back inside the range and inside the wedge. We basically break out of our resistance of our wedge. We break out the 20, we consolidate between the 55 and the 20 here. For what seemed like two or, two or so weeks. Getting a lot of stick here from everyone, by the way. Saying that uh, Polygon's never going to pump again, we're in a bear market, etc. And then what do you know? We break out, we retest both the EMAs as support, we flip bullish on our EMAs and then since then, We've been having a nice little pump, haven't we? We've come all the way up to, what is this one, 55. We come down, we hold the 20th support. We come up again to this next level of resistance. Our target that we were looking at at 170 got met. We come back down to the 20 here. And you know, we hold it like an absolute boss, didn't we? We, hold, we held the 20 here and now it looks as though we've pumped up and we're just consolidating again, aren't we? Basically vibing and consolidating as Crypto Wendy would say. Just going sideways for the most part. I always undo the range by accident like that. And you can see, you know, we're just basically going sideways, aren't we? We've formed a, you could say, probably a mini range, basically looking something like this. Where we've formed a kind of a smaller range inside the wider range here. Where we're basically just having a nice little bit of consolidation going sideways. Because, you know, the market in general has pumped a lot recently. And now we're just coming back and retesting some of those levels that we need to see as support. And that's looking really good, isn't it? And, you know, we're really pleased about what's happening with Polygon. That it's having a bit of a consolidation phase because... You know, we've come up all the way up from, what, 63, 62 and a half cents, all the way up to $1.70 in the space of about a month, which is essentially, what is that, a 3x? Basically a two and a half, maybe two and a bit more x. So really, really nice multiples on Polygon. Congratulations to anyone who bought the dip, by the way. And, you know, we really just want to see Polygon basically come up and have, it's come up now. We want to see it just hold some support, consolidate not just roll over like it could possibly but even though we do have a quite a lot of uh, support here so that seems unlikely we want to see it holding support and then you know building up some momentum for that next run up obviously the rsi coming back down instagram coming back down already but basically to tackle that next level of resistance which is going to be that range high isn't it coming up at around what is this two dollars a very very strong psychological level as well so pretty clear in our opinion that polygon's doing very well here you can see we're holding support on the 20 very nicely. We've also got the 55 here if that does break. But, you know, we're just consolidating right now and going sideways, which is, in my opinion, completely fine because it seems quite likely that we do really want to see this in the market so that we can make some strong support. 
so that when we do have that next leg up, we can fall back on this, retest it as support, and, you know, start moving up in a nice little uh, trend reversal. Because, you know, this is a downtrend, and, you know, we've made our first leg of our uptrend here, realistically. But now we just really want to see ourselves doing something like this, where we retest support and keep moving up and reversing out of here, don't we? So now that we've established the situation here, we can say some short-term price predictions. If we do start to roll over here, we've obviously got the 55 as strong support. If we do lose the 20, we would say this is strong support coinciding with the bottom of this little mini range we formed. Going along with, you know, also these previous swing highs here. Coming in at around, what is this, 130 now? We do think this would be very strong support if we do start to roll over, retest the range low again. Coinciding with that 55 for a nice bounce. But if we do start to see the market pumping, obviously we're looking at Polygon breaking out of this level here at 170, 172. Do anticipate coming up to around that $2 level as our next short-term price prediction. So that would be our next target, coming up to that next level, key level there, which would be very nice to see. And then obviously by the end of the bull run, everyone wants to know, you know, how high can Polygon go? If we take a look at our Fib extension here for our retracement on this, on this basically this recent move here from this high to this low. You can see we're looking at some very juicy price targets potentially. We do think that $5 to $10 level very possible, you know, considering, you know, this golden $10 price target that a lot of people are looking for you know considering we got all the way up to two dollar seventy and now we're launching more and more pro projects the ecosystem getting fleshed out the user adoption going up etc etc it doesn't seem unlikely to us that five dollars coinciding nicely with what what is this this one this one for our extension very very possible probably more than likely in our opinion considering how low the market cap is for polygon as well and then going upwards of that $10 mark, that would put Polygon probably at, what is it, a $40, $50, $60 billion market cap. And we do think that's very possible as well, considering, you know, how good this project is, how much adoption it's getting, the fleshing out of the network, etc. So, date today, guys. We'd like to thank everyone for watching. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please let us know down in the comments section below. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you can keep up to date with all of our videos. Remember to comment down below and be subscribed to enter into our brand new monthly giveaway for a hardware wallet. If you'd like to support the channel more directly, please sign up to our Patreon via the link in the description below, or sign up to YouTube membership by hitting the join button right next to the sub below this video, where you can get access to our private Discord. We're offering coin calls, one-to-one -one access to us personally, insight into our personal portfolio, daily research of crypto assets with massive potential, and access to our brand new 100x portfolio. With so many benefits, you might as well check it out below. Don't forget to get two free stocks with Weeble by signing up and then depositing $100 using our link in the description below. You can quite literally deposit the $100, get your two free stocks and then withdraw the money. So there's no reason not to do that and they could be valued all the way up to $1,600 each. But don't forget to actually deposit as well after signing up, otherwise you won't receive the second stock. Scammers get worse every day so make sure to protect yourself and your crypto online with PureVPN. Sign up below for some big discounts. You can get access to block content and protect yourself from phishing scams with super low monthly payments and high quality speeds. You can also sign up to our free Telegram via the description as well. All the links are in the description for affiliate links for discounts and free crypto, so go check them all out below. There's plenty of goodness on offer. Please like and subscribe. We are Crypto Maximum.